inventory control and why it's important. So my niche is new construction. I've sold thousands of new homes in the Philadelphia city and suburb markets. Uh, but this strategy of inventory control can work for just two homes. Like if you're taking a listing and you have two homes in that listing or 10 or 20 or 200, this applies. So when you take the listing, you don't just dump all of the homes into the MLS at the same time. Again, whether it's just two homes or 20. You lead with one home for many, many, many reasons. Okay, a lot of strategies behind this. But most importantly, you keep the other homes as a shadow inventory. And it allows you to, one, gauge the market, okay? And you can figure out if you priced it correctly or didn't price it correctly and not have to adjust that price because you have the shadow inventory. You can always reintroduce new listings from the development into the MLS at a higher or lower price without having to manipulate the price of the first home you entered and put onto the market. And we could talk about this in detail. There's a lot of reasons why you would and wouldn't do that. Um, you know, so it's kind of a canary down the mine shaft if you've heard that analogy. Uh, where you use that first home, introduce the development to the marketplace, see how the marketplace reacts, et cetera, et cetera. Now, sometimes the seller and you do not agree on price. So again, you have this first home to use as the tiebreaker, right? You have this first home to use to gather intel on the market and you can put it up and you know you have another three, six, nine, 20 of the same home coming. Um, and you can always adjust those, right? You also never want to create the illusion of abundance in these developments. You never want to have nine homes actively on the market, very similar to each other, all in the MLS. You know, we don't want buyers to look into the MLS and say, oh, you know, I really like this house, but there's eight more of them. Let me take my time. No, we want the opposite. We want to create urgency. We want to find ways to get buyers to see the home and make an offer, you know, make a decision, make an offer, not sit around for six months because they know there's eight more or 18 more or 40 more, okay? And this is something we could talk about for hours. Uh, but just another key point on why you need to keep inventory control at the forefront of your mind when you're listing multiple homes or condos uh, all at once.